about to tell you is top secret. There's a powerful group of people out there that are secretly running the world. I'm talking about the guys no one knows about, the guys that are invisible. Hello everyone, this is Sandra Scallon for En Escena, and today we're here on the red carpet of the premiere of Mr. Robot. Stay tuned, we'll be right back. having this show in your network, how important it is for you? Um, well, first of all, it, we're, we're thrilled to be working with, with Sam Esmail, who created Mr. Robot, and to have this show on our air. Um, from the first time we read the script, we knew it was a very unique show um, with some incredible characters. And um, so far, everything we've seen has been, uh, we've been very happy with, and we can't wait to uh, premiere it in June. Redistribution in history. What does it mean for you to be here at the Tribeca Film Festival? Well, I grew up in New York, um, so to have uh, have a project here um, at this festival is a real honor and a thrill. And the fact that it's a TV show, I think, is very interesting and different. I mean, this is the first time I've ever been involved with something like this where it's premiered at a film festival. So talk a little bit about your role in this show. My role? I'm uh, a very complicated young man. I'm. Uh, computer engineer. I work at a cybersecurity firm, so I protect these big corporations from being hacked. Oh, hi. Elliot. Just a tech. But I hate these corporations as well, so it's very difficult for me to go to work. And uh, at night, I hack into the lives of people I care about. And I kind of protect them, or maybe I um, hurt others to protect them. He's very complicated. He has a difficult time communicating with human beings, so he, he does it on this underground level. ER280652. Just a regular cybersecurity engineer, but I'm a vigilante hacker by night. And uh, I think he has a hard time figuring out where he's at with his life. He's He's really hurting and devastated and uh, by tragedy and lonely, and yet he's able to step outside of them that and help these people he cares about and seek some sort of justice for people he doesn't even know sometimes. Well, I play the therapist for Rami's character. His name is Elliot. And um, as to be discovered by the audience, Rami is very obviously, he is a genius at technology and the hacking world, etc. But when it comes to human interaction, when it comes to you know being able to connect with someone on a one-on-one -on -one basis, he has a big problem with that. He's, he's like unable to do so. Do you know? His way of connecting with people is really literally via the computer. I play Darlene, who is part of F Society, which is the underground hacking world that tries to, you know, we're trying to recruit Elliot to join us and that Christian's part of as well. And she is just like a badass hacker who writes like the most vicious codes and is the girl you want on your team if you're trying to take down anyone. Do you think this role is important for our society? Uh, well, I certainly think that the subject matter that we're dealing with is uh, very relevant to what's happening right now in the world. I mean, just hearing that the White House and got hacked and the, the president's emails were exposed. Um, I mean, that's really the, the subject that we're dealing with. 13 million dollars. That's exactly how much they lost. Who did this? It's it's a very powerful, powerful thing, this internet, and if it's in the wrong hands, it can become very dangerous. Um, I play the role of Angela, and um, she is a very pragmatic overachiever who strives to kind of climb the corporate ladder. Um, and I think, like, her struggle, kind of what she represents is someone that's, you know, hopeful and, and kind of, like, bright and does corruption corrupt her? Does working with, like, corrupt corporations, like, what does it take to be successful? I prepare, I put myself in a situation of incredible loss that I think a lot of us can relate to. And I started thinking about someone who doesn't have friends can't really talk to people, has, you know, is grieving on a daily basis, and that's devastating. So how do you like playing these kind of roles? 
Um, I liked it. I enjoyed it. Uh, I thought it was a lot of fun to play this character. Mr. Robot is, um, I think, uh, as the as the show unfolds, gets uh, more and more interesting, and we find out more and more uh, who he is and what he's about, and, and sort of what the mission is and what the goal is. So uh, I like it. I like it. I like doing TV stuff. It's it's fun. It uh, it's like it's a fast moving train, and you really have to be prepared every day. Coming this June, Mr. Robot at USA Network. This was Sandra Scallon for En La Cena. Oh, hi. Elliot, just a tech.